Yum, yum! William Vaughn here with a quick tip for using weight maps as layer masks in Modo. Although primarily used for rigging, in this video I'll create a weight map and use it to aid in texturing a mesh. This character currently has two weight maps being used as layer masks to provide secondary color detail to the head. Let's add more detail with a third weight map. Start by creating a new weight map. Give the weight map a unique name, toggle the initial value option off, and click OK. There are many ways to add weight values to a mesh, but I like painting on values with the paintbrush. After some initial values are in place, use the smooth brush to soften the transition between what has been painted and the areas with no value. In the shader tree, add a constant layer and choose a color. Add a vertex map texture layer and choose the new weight map to drive the layer. Drag the vertex map layer into the constant and it'll convert the vertex map layer to a layer mask. Although the constant layer flood fills the entire material group, the weight map masks the constant layer, allowing us to limit the color to where the weight values have been applied. The higher the value, the more opaque the color will appear. Oh, look at the time. <laughs> <laughs> 